Well, yet more breaking news, my friends. This is just amazing to watch God work. I just got through doing a video for you guys today showing you that Turkey, who is a huge Gog, Magog war confederate, said that she is going to wipe Israel off the map with a little help from her friends. Now, more breaking news, Iran, the second of the three-part triad of the main henchmen, just backed up Turkey and said that she is going to destroy Israel as well. So now we've got Turkey, we've got Iran, and Russia up this way, up north, who is Gog, Putin of Magog, Russia. That is the evil triangle. And Putin is, God's going to put the hook in Putin Gog's mouth to draw him down from Magog to little Israel. And the hook, I believe, I'm convinced, is all the oil, all the natural gas that Israel has just of grabbed a hold of, plus all the land that Israel is going to grab when she defeats her immediate neighbors in the Psalm 83 war. I believe that combination will draw Putin and Russia, Iran and Turkey, the big wheels, and then the little guys like Libya and Sudan, those are small fry, in to attack Israel. See, she's surrounded by all areas. They'll try to push her into the Red Sea like Pharaoh did, but it won't happen because God will destroy 90% of all their armies and wipe them off the face of the map. You do not mess with God's chosen people. You don't do it. This is amazing how fast things are happening. We need to wake up and understand that we are on the threshold of eternity, that the rapture, Harpazo, catching away, it, it's imminent. And sadly, a great deal of Christians are about to be left behind along with the unsaved because they're backsliders. They refuse to repent the way that hundreds of scriptures say that you have to. I've proven it without any doubt at all, period, that you must repent of your sins after you're saved. Repentance is not works. We're saved by grace alone. No matter works can save us or keep us saved. Repentance is a separate entity. And you have to be, <coughs> excuse me, you have to be ready at all times because if you're left behind, you'll be here for seven years of a hellish nightmare where billions to be will die the most grotesque, awful, terrible, horrific deaths imaginable. Why go through all of that? Jesus Christ is your only hope. If you've never been saved, you're backslidden. Pray the prayer. Do the six steps I have in the box. Blow the video. No one's guaranteed more time in your life. If you like prayer, contact me. I pray for you every day without fail. True Christians, look up, my friends. Our definition draweth nigh. We fly soon. Witness and pray what little time we have left. Share this video. Get the word out. May God bless you and take care and wake up.